If I told you that stress could bleach your hair from the inside out, would you believe me? And what if I said that there is a little known vitamin that might reverse this greying of hair? Hi, I'm Dr. Alpna Mohata, a board certified dermatologist and today we'll be discussing greying of hair. Why it happens, what are the most common causes and most importantly how you can reverse it. Before we talk about why hair loses color, we need to understand why it has color in the first place. Deep inside each hair follicle, there are tiny pigment factories called melanocytes. These cells make melanin. Hair has two types of melanin, eumelanin for brown or black hair and pheomelanin for blonde or red hair. The more pigment in your hair, the deeper the color. Now, as the years go by, pigment producing cells slow down and some stop working altogether. Less pigment means graying of hair. No pigment means white hair. Genetics played the biggest role here, which is why some people would spot gray in their 20s while others barely have any even until their 50s. Ethnicity matters too. On average, Caucasian hair grays first, followed by Asian and then African hair. Beyond genetics, premature graying of hair or graying before the age of 25 years can be linked to health factors like thyroid disorder, vitamin deficiency, especially B5, B6, B12 and vitamin D, chronic stress, smoking and certain cytotoxic medications. Autoimmune conditions, malnutrition, environmental toxins can also play a role. So can we slow down the graying of hair or even reverse it in the first place? Interestingly, calcium pantothenate, a form of vitamin B5, has been shown to help with promoting the repigmentation of hair. Pantothenic acid deficiency has been linked with early greying of hair, the dullness of hair, and even hair fall. Calcium pantothenate supplements often come along with other supportive nutrients like biotin, zinc, and copper. The health and color of our hair also depend on micronutrients like zinc, selenium, copper and iron. Copper activates the enzymes that make melanin. Selenium is a powerful antioxidant that protects pigment producing cells from oxidation. Zinc has a role in hair follicle promotion. And iron helps deliver oxygen directly to the hair follicles so pigment producing cells stay active. If you are low in any of these micronutrients, spraying of hair can happen and fixing these deficiencies can help in slowing down and even reversing graying of hair. And there is also a growing list of all of these anti-graying actors which promise to stimulate the production of melanin and reverse the graying of hair when applied topically. I have made a list of all of them, let me tell you about them one by one. Okay, so the first one is dark null. It stimulates the stem cells to produce more melanin. Some studies show that there is up to 56% reduction after just 4 months of usage of dark nil. But it's best used for early grain. Then there is palmitoyl tetrapeptide 20, which is a peptide that has been shown to have 50 to 60% gray hair reduction in early trials. The results might honestly be too good to be true, but if we can have even a little bit of reversal of green hair, I think it's a good deal. There is also some buzz around lutolin, which is a natural antioxidant found in rosemary, celery and onions. It has been found in mice to reverse greying of hair, but human trials are still pending. And then we have low light laser therapy, antioxidants and hormone based therapies like melatonin and alpha MSH. All of these are being studied right now, but only time will tell if they actually work or not. And finally, there are some medications which were found to accidentally reverse the graying of hair or promote the production of dark hair, like a prostaglandin analog called latinoprost. But all in all, nothing can revive a gray or white hair once the melanocytes are completely destructed. So at the end of the day, it's better to embrace your grays instead of fearing them. And if you're somebody like me who likes to cover their grey with colour, you do you. Also for a more sustainable hair health, having a good lifestyle, but a sleep schedule, stress reduction, eating balanced food with a lot of antioxidants and berries is your best bet. And say no to smoking.
So guys, I hope you found this video useful. If you have any questions, doubts or concerns, please drop them in the comment section of the video. If there are any active ingredients that have actually worked for you in reversing your greying of hair or even slowing it down, drop them in the comment section of this video. With that, this is Dr. Alpina signing off.